guys, it's Brandon with Share the Shred. I got this uh, neat little bash guard for Christmas and I figured I'd do a little uh, product installation, my first one. Uh, let me know in the comments what you think about uh, this video and uh, if you would like to see some more uh, installations or anything in the future uh, of any type of product, just uh, throw them in the comments. Uh, this is the fun Zippa Light Bash Guard. I'm gonna be putting it on in just a moment. We'll pull it out of the box and see what it's all about. All right, so you can pull it out of the box, see what they all, they give you. So it looks like uh, the typical bash guard. Looks like uh, you gotta you're able to replace the actual bash guard portion uh, in case yours gets pretty damaged or anything crazy happens. And then they give you the uh, mounting screws and bolts for a couple different types of uh, mounts of bikes. And then uh, this guy right here, this is an extra bash guard. It's pretty nice. Uh, be saving that for sure in case uh, I damage mine. And then they give you a little teeny bit of instructions right here. Um, pretty simple. Um, I think we can probably get it on without taking off the, uh, basically taking off the um, crank. So let's uh, see if we can do that. But here's the product up close. So All right, so we have this washer right here. I'll show you it. It's right here, this guy. You wanna make sure this goes between this and the bash guard that you're installing. It's gonna go in front of it from the direction we're looking in between the crank and the frame and the mount is right outside of the frame just go like this try to finagle it up in there like so Just gonna screw it in now. Get it going. It's locked tight on it, so it's gonna be a little, a little tough to turn, but it should be good. Okay. I'm just gonna leave it a little loose so we can adjust it. And then we're gonna take the other guy and do the same thing. See, it's a little tricky getting it in, but it's, you know, you don't have to deal with the crank, putting the crank, taking the crank off, crank arm. This guy just a little bit so I can finagle the other screw in. Hardest part is just trying to keep that mount the washer in between the bash guard and the plate so that's that's the trick there but once you get it you just start screwing it in and uh, just like so you can also adjust it if you want so you get it to fit the shape of basically your your chain in your crank. Just gonna tighten this up now. I think I, I think I have it where I want it pretty much. Alright, then we're gonna tighten the other guy, come back here. Crank arm around. Get nice and tight in there. All right. Well, there you guys have it. The fun Zippa Light Bash Guard install. Should only take five to 10 minutes max, depending on how tricky it is to get behind your machinery to install it on the mounts. 
Um, this one works for 26 tooth all the way up to 32 tooth. And like I said it had, earlier, it has a, an adjustment where you can finagle it and uh, make it work for your bike. So hopefully that helps with uh, deciding to buy it or not and check it out. It's on Amazon Prime. I will throw the link in the description. If you have any questions or comments, throw them in the comments box and uh, I'll try to answer them when I can. And uh, happy shredding to you and I hope to share the shred sometime soon.